So in order to uninstall Battle.net, it's actually very simple. And the first thing you might want to do is uninstall the games on Battle.net. So you want to go ahead and load it up. Then you want to click on the game you want to uninstall and then click on options and then go ahead and click on uninstall game and go from there. So now our Battle.net games have been uninstalled, it's actually time to remove the program. So to do this, you want to click on the Windows icon in the bottom left and you want to type in add or remove. And you want to click on add or remove programs at the top. Now the settings should load up and what you want to do is scroll down until you find Battle.net. I want to go ahead and click on it and then click on uninstall and click on uninstall a game and follow the process from there. So now battle.net has been uninstalled from my computer. We just need to go ahead and remove a couple more files that have been left over from the uninstallation process. So to do this, you want to right click on your Windows icon in the bottom left. Then you want to go ahead and click on run. Then you want to go ahead and type in percent update percent and click on OK. Now you want to find the file called battle.net and you want to go ahead and delete that file. Once we've done that, we just need to follow the same process again. So right click on our Windows icon and click on run. And this time you want to go ahead and type in percent program data percent and click on OK. Now you want to find the files called battle.net and Blizzard Entertainment. And again, you just want to go ahead and delete these files. This means that if you ever want to reinstall battle.net in the future, you will have a truly clean installation of the program. And if you want to go ahead and reinstall battle.net, I will leave a link in the description where you can go ahead and download the installer from the website. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you for watching and have a good day.